for a couple visiting a fertility clinic, um, this concern would have definitely arisen at least once uh, uh, during the visits, where they are uh, still in doubt whether the right kind of gametes going to making the embryo which is going to be transferred to them. Now, uh, as far as the lab is concerned, there are certain processes in place where we ensure that a mix-up doesn't happen. Now, usually two people are involved in the whole process of handling the gametes, where the person who does the process or the embryologist always has a person supervising her process. Whenever the process is going to complete, the other person gives a go-ahead to complete the process. Now, one of the adverse effects of witnessing the uh, gametes is the fact that somebody has to interrupt their work, get back to the person who is doing the process and then again go back to his or her work. And this kind of plays with the efficiency of work in a lab. In such a scenario, we have uh, certain technical advancements available these days where we label the containers which handle these gametes and they can be either labeled manually or electronically and we have certain readers available which capture the data of where the gametes came from, whether they belong to the same couple to which the embryo is finally going to go to and that is how we ensure that the gametes are not mismatched in the whole process in the lab.